Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. In today's video, I'll be showing you how you can install and set up Exibase for Office theme. And this is a theme that you can use for conference, events, seminar, food festivals, and so on. And here you can see simple and easy to use conference and event for Office theme. There are multiple demos available that you can see here 15 plus smart demos. And you can use any of these. You can see home one, creative conference, classic one, multi events. This is for the food festival and so on. So you can pick any of these and you can use the one that you need. So let me show you one of them and then I'll show you how you can get this theme and how you can set this up. So let's say I need this one. I'll open this. And this is one of the demo. Okay. Here you can see on the top we have the logo, then navigation menu with all the required pages, about pages, speakers, schedule, blog, and buy tickets. And this is the main section where we have this main title, then a timer and buy ticket call to action. And if I scroll down, you will see this section. And by the way, this is completely customizable. So here you can change the text. You can change this text, also the icons, the numbers and so on. This is for the speakers. You can open any of these and you can view details and so on. This is another section. Another one. Then we have these workshops get your ticket so basically pricing table latest news these are our sponsors and then contact section buy ticket and uh, also a newsletter form and this is the footer so this is one of the home pages you can explore all these pages i'll provide a link in the description and you can pick the one that you need and now let's go back and let me show you how you can get this theme and how you can set this up so to get this theme you can follow the link in the description which will take you to this page. Here you can see the theme title and this is the price. This is one time price so you can just buy this theme and you can use this for lifetime. You don't have to renew this price. So to buy this you can just click on add to cart. Then go to checkout and pay for this theme. I already have this theme let me show you. And after buying this theme you will get a file like this. Now you just need to upload this to your workers. So for that let's go to our WordPress dashboard and for creating any type of websites that is either a personal website, a business website, e-commerce websites, you will need to have a domain name and hosting and basically domain name is your website name. People will land on your page on your website after typing the URL and hosting in simple words is an online storage where your website files will be stored where you can manage SSL certificate, your domains, your emails your databases, PHP versions and everything related to your website will be managed and the control panel and the hosting. You can also contact your hosting provider for any issue on your website or you can fix your issues right in the cPanel. And there are multiple platforms available that will provide you domain and hosting. The one I would suggest is Hostinger and if you follow this link in the description you will get a discount on hosting. You will also get a free domain with hosting. Let me show you. So if you go to this link in the description and scroll down, you will see the plans here. So this is for single website as you can see single WordPress, WordPress starter and so on. And these are the pricing you can see very normal and very affordable. If you scroll down, you will learn more about these plans. So here you can host one website, you will get this amount of storage, this amount of bandwidth. This one doesn't include a free domain and have weekly backups and so on. And with all these three plans, you will also get a free domain, unlimited SSL, which is this lock icon. This make your website trustworthy and secure. And you can get this amount of RAM, this amount of cores of CPU and so on. Please don't get confused here. Just select any of these plans based on your budget and based on your website visitor and storage. And normally this plan will work for you as you can see this is most popular one. So just add this to cart. And this will take you to cart page where you can see the overview of the plan that we have selected. And then you can scroll down and you can choose a favorite. So if you want to get this for 1 month, 12 months, 24 and so on. So the more time you choose here the more discount you will get. Now the normal price here is 432 but if you scroll down with the discount you will get this hosting with 143 USD and this is for 4 years. So just create an account here or log in with Facebook or Google. Then pay for this hosting and you will get this hosting for 4 years with a free domain for 1 year. So once you pay for this then this will take you to its dashboard. Let me show you. And this is how your dashboard will look. And you will see the hosting plan that you have selected with your domain name. And you can also create free domain emails using this plan. 
So this is how you can get a domain name and hosting and now let me show you how you can install WordPress on your hosting. So to install WordPress, just go to your dashboard like this and then click on manage in front of your hosting. So let's click on this and before installing WordPress, let me visit the domain just to show you. You can see there is nothing and we are set to go which means that our domain is ready we just need to install WordPress on this. So let's go back and to install WordPress, you can scroll down, go to websites and you will see WordPress. Just click on that and if you don't see WordPress, you can go to auto installer and you will find WordPress. So let's click on WordPress and the first option is to detect WordPress. So if you are not sure that this domain has WordPress or not, you can detect your WordPress by clicking here. So this is brand new domain and we don't have any WordPress installation here. So I'll just click on install WordPress. And here we can type our website title, our email, username and password and we'll select our domain. That's it. So let me quickly fill this. And here make sure to choose HTTPS and don't write anything here. We want our website directly on our domain and then we'll click next. And then you can select the WordPress version. So the most recent one is recommended. You can choose your website language. Disk base and PHP version are fine. And you can select update only minor version. And then click install. And that's it. Now this will install WordPress on this domain and I'll show you. And now you can notice the dashboard is different and if you scroll down you will see more options and you will also see WordPress version installed here and now let's check our domain so if I refresh this we got a 2023 theme with hello world post you can find this theme and the post in the WordPress dashboard and to access the WordPress dashboard you can go back and here you can click on edit website and this will take you to WordPress dashboard and this is the WordPress dashboard where we can install themes, we can install plugins and we can start creating the website. And now I am in WordPress dashboard. This is first installation. We don't have any themes and plugins. So to upload the theme, you can just go to appearance, themes, and then click add new, upload theme, and then choose file. And then select that file. So I'll select this, we'll click open and install now. And now you can go ahead and activate this theme. And after activating the theme, this will take you to the dashboard where you can activate the license. Now for the license, you will need its purchase code. Let me show you how you can get its purchase code. And here is a guide for you. Here is my purchase code. So here you can log into your email account first. Then go to downloads page. And in the front of that theme, you can just click on that arrow. Okay. You will get this. So you can download the theme here and you can also download the purchase license. So this is how your purchase code will look like. This is just a demo one. You can just copy this and then you can paste it in the theme activation. So let's see how we can activate that theme. And here we will write a name, an email, and then its purchase code. And then we'll click on activate license. And you can see your license is activated. And just like other premium themes, you will get this notice to install these plugins to run this theme properly. So you can just click on begin installing plugins. And these are the required plugins. So you can select all, click bulk action and choose install then click apply and this will install the plugins and if you are having any issues here just like this you can just go back to install plugins and you can install them one by one so I'll just click on install this will install the plugin I'll go back we'll install this one and this way you can install and activate all the plugins now let's go to plugins and make sure to activate all plugins and here you can see these plugins are not activated so we will select all we'll choose activate and apply and that's it now we have installed and activated all the plugins this is elementor so you can connect your account here to use some advanced features like elementor ai but let's close this for now and that's it now we have installed the theme and all the plugins but still if i visit this website we have nothing here we just have this hello world post so let's see how we can get this whole website and then how we can customize it okay so let's go to our wordpress dashboard again and each theme have different import options so in this theme you can go to tools and here you will see demo content install just click on that and this will show you all the demos that i showed you earlier so you can again preview any of these by checking its live review and then you can choose the one that you want and if you want all the home pages and all the demos you can choose this one because this is you can see main demo from 1 to 11 home pages and this is the same demo as this one you can see here so instead of this, let's choose this one because this will make our process simple and will not import the extra pages because I don't need all these pages. So let's choose this one. I'll click install. 
and you can see this notice installing demo content will delete all the content but that's okay we will click okay and this will start importing the demo so let's wait for this and after importing the content this will reload the page and will take you to your website and here we have the website so this is the header with all the required pages navigation menu call to action main section and this section that i showed you the speakers and so on so this is how you can install this theme and how you can set up the demo content now let me quickly show you that how you can customize this website based on your needs for example you want to make changes to text to this image to this and so on you can just edit any page with elementor you can do it from two places like you can see this bar you can click on edit with elementor to edit this page or you can go to your dashboard and if you see this notice then just update database and then continue and then this will take you to dashboard where you can go to pages and here you will see all the pages so now you can edit any of these pages so the main page here is the front page which is the home you can click on edit with elementor here or here so let's edit with elementor and this is the image generator by AI. I already have a video about this. Let's close this. Let's close this. And now we can start customizing everything. Let's say I want to change this title. I can click on this. Then I can change the text here. I can write my own text. That's it. This is the navigator where you can navigate to different sections. Like this is the first section. And we have two columns layout. You can see here. And then we have text which is this one. Then heading which is this. Then countdown which is this and so on if you want to edit countdown you can click on this and here you can change the countdown like this and that's it same goes for all these content okay if you if you click this this is just a feature box you can change its styling here like this is style one two three you can keep any of these then this is the number which is this one this is the networking title and this is the description so again you can make changes very easily using Elementor. Same goes for all these okay. This is the speaker name you can see here you can choose any of the speakers. These are coming from your Wolfish dashboard. And same goes for all these content like you can click on any content and you can customize that. So this is how you can customize this website. And that's not it. If you want to add extra features like if you want to add products, you want to add sliders. You can follow my channel I have lots of videos about Elementor where I have showed you different themes and different strategies about Elementor. I have shared lots of Elementor free add-ons that you can add to your website absolutely for free. So make sure to subscribe to the channel and follow for more videos like this. And still if you have any questions about this video you can ask in the comment section. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next.